Big Meat Eater, 1982, directed by Chris Windsor, starring George Dawson, Clarence Big Miller, and Andrew Gillies. The butcher of a small town unwittingly hires the man who secretly murdered the crooked town mayor and stashed his body in the freezer. While this is happening, aliens plot to harvest a deposit of rare fuel under the butcher's shop, and an aspiring young genius strives to fly into outer space. If you took John Waters, 50s and 60s B-movies, and a campy musical and threw them in a blender, this film is what you would end up with. This is a legitimate musical, too. Characters literally burst into song and dance to toe-tapping musical numbers multiple times throughout the film. The story is an absolute mess, but it's thoroughly entertaining and serves as the backdrop for its bizarre cast. George Dawson carries the film as Bob Sanderson, the likable and easygoing butcher. Clarence Big Miller plays Abdullah, the murderer who becomes a butcher's apprentice. Abdullah, the butcher. Now, where have I heard that name before? Finally, Andrew Gillies plays young genius Jan Wazinski. Windsor purposely casted someone far older to play the teenage character, a wink and a nod to the casting of adults as teens in films like 1958's The Blob. The rest of the film is populated by equally eccentric and memorable characters. It's very much an ensemble film. The story behind the production of this film is fascinating. Director Chris Windsor came forward in 2018 to tell his story in an article. I'll include the link in the description below. There's some deliberately cheesy effects in this film as well, including a UFO clearly teetering on fishing line and aliens portrayed using wind-up robots. Verdict? Highly recommended. A film that is as entertaining as it is strange. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi or horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling, low-budget adventure.